Welcome to the Health Benefits Hub channel. Exploring the surge in cancer rates, particularly for colon cancer, reveals a concerning trend that transcends age demographics, impacting not only the elderly, but also younger generations. In this examination, we delve into the reasons behind this alarming increase and provide insights into prevalent symptoms associated with colon cancer. Colon cancer poses a significant challenge in the current medical landscape, holding the third position in terms of diagnosis frequency and the second in lethality, underscoring its profound impact. What intensifies the battle against this disease is the pervasive industry enveloping it. Driven by profit motives, inundated with misleading advertisements, and burdened with complex data, this landscape often leaves both patients and healthcare practitioners perplexed. Contrary to a widespread misconception emphasizing genetics as the primary determinant of susceptibility to colon cancer, recent insights suggest a more nuanced reality. While a familiar history can contribute to a modest 5 to 10% of cases, it falls short of providing a comprehensive understanding. Genetics may establish a foundation, but lifestyle choices emerge as crucial factors influencing the onset of the disease. Contemporary research underscores the pivotal role of diet and lifestyle in preventing or even reversing this ailment. Antioxidant-rich foods heralded for their potential in combating various chronic afflictions are not mere conjecture, but represent a burgeoning field of scientific inquiry that shapes the trajectory of future medical practices. Oh, a quick favor. We'd greatly appreciate it if you can subscribe and like. This helps the YouTube algorithm recognize the value of our content and share it more widely. Embarking on the journey of understanding the nuances of colon cancer? Eager to identify red flags signaling its presence and recognize indicators of advanced stages? Let's embark on this enlightening exploration. The enigmatic colonoscopy serves as a key player in revealing the onset of colon cancer, allowing us to peer into the intricate realm of our intestines. But who should undergo this probing procedure? And how can we thwart the sinister transformation of polyps? Contrary to common belief, colon cancer often lurks undetected for years, disguising itself as a leisurely growing polyp. Initially subtle and inconspicuous, it skillfully evades detection. As a preventative measure, individuals at higher risk, especially those over 45 or 50, and those with a family history, are advised to undergo a colonoscopy. This procedure serves not only to detect, but also to remove lurking polyps, playing a crucial role in early intervention. The symptoms of colon cancer vary based on tumor size and location. Tumors on the right side present challenges, causing liquid stools and hindering obstruction. However, there's a hope amidst uncertainty Early detection is paramount. Stay vigilant for subtle signs that may offer a glimmer of hope in the face of this formidable challenge. Tumors with their unruly growth often engage in discreet bleeding. However, this bleeding remains hidden from view. Here's a clever trick. Delve into stool samples. Yes, you heard it right. Concealed blood unveils itself in these samples serving as a telltale sign of trouble. Dispatch the sample to the lab for thorough scrutiny. Alternatively, you can rely on the trusty colonoscopy, a steadfast defender in the ongoing battle against cancer. However, exercise caution and be vigilant for subtle signs. Chronic bleeding can lead to anemia, leaving you pale and fatigued, especially as you approach the milestone of 45 or 50 years. If you observe this, Coupled with darker stools, don't procrastinate. An underlying tumor may be lurking. Now, let's shift our focus to the left side of the intestinal arena. 
Here, obstructions tend to strike earlier. Why? Because feces are already solid, containing less water compared to their counterparts on the right. But what symptoms might serve as harbingers of colon cancer's presence? A common symptom of colon cancer is a noticeable shift in bowel patterns. If your regular routine involves daily or bi-daily bathroom visits and suddenly shifts to experiencing constipation with no bowel movements for a week or two, it should raise concerns. Additionally, the shape of fecal matter may undergo alterations, thinning as it traverses the intestine. Individuals might also encounter episodes of diarrhea alternating with spells of constipation. Chronic diarrhea is another symptom that often prompts doctors to consider a colonoscopy for tumor checks. In advanced stage tumors, distinct x-ray images resembling a bitten apple may indicate narrowed intestinal passages, hindering fecal movement and causing visible bright red bleeding. Stool may darken due to the presence of blood. Similar to right-sided colon cancer, other symptoms of advanced stages encompass abdominal discomfort from gas buildup, swelling, weight loss, fatigue, and internal organ issues such as liver pain or difficulties in breathing related to the lungs. This underscores the importance of detection and natural prevention methods. Stay tuned for essential insights. Intestinal polyps, usually harmless growths extending from the lining of the intestine, often show no symptoms. Detecting them is best done through a colonoscopy, which not only provides a visual of the polyp, but also allows for its extraction and examination to determine whether it is benign or malignant. Despite their typically benign nature, a small fraction of these polyps can transform into cancerous entities over time, forming the core message of our video. Contrary to past beliefs, the metamorphosis of these polyps is influenced by a combination of genetic factors and lifestyle behaviors. Genes, rather than being fixed, respond to our actions. Thwarting the advance of colon cancer involves recognizing the influence of dietary choices. A balanced diet and healthy habits play a crucial role impacting gene expression and regulating the activity of genes associated with chronic conditions, such as inflammation, dementia, obesity, heart disease, and cancer. Conversely, poor dietary habits and unhealthy routines can amplify the activity of these genes, potentially fueling the growth of polyps and pushing them towards malignant transformation over time. The video delves into what accelerates this ominous metamorphosis. Several factors contribute to the heightened risk of colon cancer, including the consumption of ultra-processed foods containing excessive red meats, particularly processed varieties like sausages and salami, the detrimental impact of bad fats, particularly vegetable oils, excluding olive oil, a surge in sugar intake, and an excess of sodium, especially from ultra-processed foods, can act as catalysts exacerbating the conditions conducive to tumor growth. These carcinogenic products intensify the risk alongside factors such as constipation, inadequate gut microbiota, and chronic inflammation. Habits like alcohol consumption and smoking further contribute to this menacing risk. The antidote to thwart colon cancer involves prioritizing single ingredient foods, inherently avoiding ultra-processed options, opt for a diet rich in anti-inflammatory and antioxidant foods, envisioning a spectrum of fruits and vegetables, regular doses of turmeric, and indulging in healthy fats from omega-3 sources like salmon, tuna, or plant-based alternatives such as chia, flaxseed, and sesame. Incorporate avocados and eggs from free-range chickens for their abundance in healthy fats. Prioritize hydration and fiber to combat constipation and promote gut health. Brace holistic lifestyle choices, including sufficient sleep, regular exercise, and fostering social connections. 
as potent anti-inflammatory and antioxidant measures. Nuts and seeds, especially pumpkin seeds, can enhance intestinal vitality. Addressing diverticula and diverticulitis, recent extensive studies debunk the myth that indulging in seeds and nuts, even with their outer coats, heightens the risk of these conditions. On the contrary, these foods can fortify intestinal function and potentially serve as protective measures against colon cancer. However, individual assessment is crucial and expert advice should be sought if intestinal issues persist. The colonoscopy, a pivotal medical procedure, is designed to detect colon cancer in its early stages. This intricate process involves the insertion of a lengthy tube with a camera at its end into the intestine through the anal passage. The camera meticulously scans the entire intestinal tract, scrutinizing for anomalies such as polyps, tumors, and lesions. Upon discovery, polyps are promptly removed and subjected to laboratory scrutiny to determine their nature, whether benign or malignant. To ensure patient comfort, the procedure is carried out under sedation or mild anesthesia, alleviating any potential pain. Most patients undergo the process without discomfort and often do not recall it afterward. Generally recommended for individuals starting at the age 45 or 50, colonoscopies might be advised early -er for those with a family history of cancer. Subsequent procedures are typically spaced a decade apart unless otherwise directed by a healthcare professional. While generally considered safe, colonoscopy is not entirely without risk. Though minimal potential complications such as bleeding or injury to the intestinal wall are rare, occurring in just one or two out of every thousand procedures. Please share in the comments below your experiences with colon cancer prevention and colon cancer so that we can all learn from each other.